Hi guys, in this video I am going to discuss about join in Oracle database. So at here I am using Toad for Oracle and currently working on uh, EMP3 and DPT1 table. So let's see the record here, EMP3 table. So this is the records, total numbers of rows are 4 and in e DPT1 table, so total numbers of rows add here 5. So about the join, so by using join we can relate to or two or more tables. So let's understand by example. So first add here about the join. So basically in Oracle or any SQL database there are four types of join. First is inner join or we can say simple join, left outer join or we can write left join, right outer join, right join, full outer join and full join. So let's see one by one. So about the inner join, so it return only matching record. Suppose add here the table A and here the table B. So if you provide any columns, matching columns, okay, DPT number as in uh, suppose EMP table and uh, DPT number add here DPT tables. So DPT number is the common columns. So whatever the column, common columns records are matched. So that return. So this is the part of A here. This is the part of A. And this is the part of B. So whatever the matching values that return by on by using inner chart. So let's understand by example. So add here. Going to write inner chart query. So select star from. So add here the first table going to use EMP3. So add here EMP3 and here after write in a jack. In a jack and here joining with DPT1. And for this we have to use on clause and here in EMP3 or DPT number is the common column. So here yeah, dpt number and here after in dpt1 or dpt number is the common column. So this is here yeah, inner chain. So see add here or uh, in or uh, this two drivers rows 20 and 10 are common. So see add here 20 20 it's uh, a giant and here yeah, this is the record it's a display. And 10 and 10 here it's giant and this is the record here it's a display. So see right here in EMP3 or uh, 10 and 20 and in DPT1. So add here 10 and 20. So this or uh, two rows are common between EMP3 and DPT table. So by using of uh, inner giant we can only return matching records. So next thing is if you want to or uh, display some particular columns record. So here yeah, you can do that. And one more thing, add here DPT number, DPT number is the common column. So this is a DPT number, it's come from MP3 table and here DPT number underscore one. So it's a system generated of uh, columns uh, because uh, name cannot be the same. So if this is the DPT number, it's uh, here in EMP3, here DPT number. And the same name at here DPT number inside to DPT1 table. So that here it's a system generated a new column name DPT number underscore 1. So you're going to display some particular column. So you can also do that. So let's reuse EMP3. EMP3. If you press dot and you have to going to use in EMP3 EMP number columns. And here after in or DPT or table going to use and here or DPT number. No, let's execute that. So you can in dpt okay we have to use dpt1 
No, let's execute one more time. See right here, it's a display. Only two columns records. Now here after the next thing is let's give a star right here. So a star indicate all the columns from the two tables. So if you execute here, see this is the record joining or matching record, it's a display. So at here you can try to so at here you can use inner join or only you can write at here join. So let's go there and I'm not going to use inner so you can achieve the same records here. So if you want there you can write inner join or you can simply write join. So it written only matching record. Now the next part is a oh, left outer join. So it written first left table record and the matching record from the right table. So suppose so this is the left table. So it will display all the record from the left and here whatever the matching values. So that return. So let's see by example. So EMP3 is my left table. So this will display all the record from here and only matching. So matching value is a 1020. So at here it's a 1020. So first that return uh, this all value and matching value 1020. So let's copy that one. And uh, here going to use left giant. Left giant. Now execute this query. So see right here. Uh, this is the matching values 10, 20. So let's see. Or 10, 20, 30 and 90. So at here you get 10, 20, 30 and 90. So left table is EMP3. So it returned all the matching values and or uh, it returned left to table record. So it left table EMP3. So it returned all the EMP3 and matching values from the right table. So at here 10, 20 is the matching value. So this is about left chart or you can try it at a left order. The same output you will get. So at here this is the null because at here 30 has so no any combination so that. Now the next is the right order chart. So about the right order chart. So it written right table records. So all the right table records and the matching records only uh, from the left table. So first that display all the record from the right table and matching. So this is here yeah, matching rows plus non-matching rows from the right side table. So add here in right side table. So right side table is the DPT1. So add here that display 50, 60, 10, 20 and 40. And 10, 20 is the matching. So that's come from oh, 10, 20 inside EMP3 inside also. So that display. Now here after let's include the right. So right here this all value first that display. So see right here or 10 or 20, 50 or 60. So this all value it's a display. Now here after or 10, 20 is the matching values. So 10, 20 it's also comes inside EMP3 and TPT1. So that it's a display all this. Or here you can write only right chain. So if you write same output, you will gain it. So I have same output. Now the next chain is the full chain, or we can say full outer chain. So it will then return matching rows plus non-matching rows from the both table. So add here, let's write full chain. So it will combine matching, non-matching, everything. So see right here. So it's come from. So this is the first part. At here, see, EMP3. So 3019. So first that to return left part. 
So at here 3090, so no any matching value, so it's a return here 3090. Now here after a 1020, so 1020 is match with a common DPT number between EMP3 and DPT1. And here, so this is the part of DPT1. So this value it's come from DPT1. So it returns all the matching non-matching values here by using full join. Or we can try it at here full outer join. Same output you will print. Same output here it's a display. So this is about to join in Oracle database. So I hope guys this video is helpful for you. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next video. Thank you.